How big is a portable washer machine? I can only speak on the Black & Decker portable washer machine that is 0.9 cubic feet. And may I say, it is just what you need for one person to keep up on their laundry weekly. So it's very small. It doesn't fit much. So let's begin. We have one sweatpants going in. Another pair of pants. One tank top, two tank top, and it's only supposed to be 75% capacity inside the drum. So as you saw, two pairs of adult pants, two tank tops, perhaps you could fit in like three underwears and two pairs of socks. So as you see, it's not a lot. Um, it's just enough to get you by through the week. Definitely will not fit a queen size blanket. Okay. If you want a true comparison, you would have to look at the drum. And I know it's hard to visualize how big this washer machine is on video. If you can imagine three one gallon paint cans. It is probably about 3.5 paint cans high. Not necessarily the height, more so the overall, the overall size of it, height and the cubed dimensions. Compared to a full size, The full size is much more massive of a cube and once it's in your laundry room, if you're like me, you don't have a lot of room left. So the portable is exponentially smaller. It will save you space, but again, it is very limited in what it could do. It could wash queen size sheets, a single sheet, and it can wash two full-sized bath towels and you're just you're pushing it at that point so if you really want to know the size go to walmart or wherever target find yourself a a uh a plastic trash bin look for the 5.5 gallon this is about how big the drum is inside of the uh the washer machine the drum inside the washing machine is slightly, and I say slightly bigger in the sense that it's round. It's a round circular drum. But when you go to the store and you pick up a 5.5 gallon plastic trash bin and hold it, and remember, um, you can only fill it to 75% capacity. So look in. Picture 75% capacity, and that's gonna give you a really good idea of how big a portable washer machine is and how much clothes you could fit inside of it. So 5.5 gallon trash bin, picture it slightly bigger in a circle, in a circular drum, and there you have it. That would be a portable 0.9 cubic foot portable washer as opposed to this full-size massive washing machine, in which case it actually does huge drum versus a smaller drum. Let me take the clothes out so you can see it better. 3.6 cubic feet. And it's quite a massive drum versus this tiny little 0.9 cubic foot washer machine. It's a very tiny drum. It will not even fit a queen size blanket. So it's not so much the cube itself, it's actually how big the drum is 
that's going to determine how much clothes can go into it. So let's uh, try to fit this in, this queen size blanket. <laughs> um, if you cram it in there, but again, you are not supposed to cram it in there. You're supposed to only use 75% of the capacity. So if you do this, you're risking it because you're going against the directions saying, hey, it should only be 75% capacity and you shouldn't cram it in there. Uh, there's a possibility you could off balance it and it's going to start vibrating. You're going to mess things up. So um, I haven't tried it, but I really don't want to if you read the instruction manual. So you go into the 3.6 cubic foot one. You could fit this entire queen size blanket in. And in addition, you can also fit one towel, two towels, three towels, four towels. So as you can see, the uh, 3.6 cubic foot washer is exponentially bigger and could hold a bigger load versus this tiny portable 0.9 cubic foot washer. One last comparison. Um, let's see this one too. We fit four towels in the full size and a queen size blanket. Let's even try to fit two, two towels inside the portable. One and two, yeah, two. It will fit two, and even then you're pushing it because it's full, let's say. In the manual, it should be 75% full. And I noticed that when I do a uh, run it with two towels to the full capacity, it starts to vibrate a lot, so. Okay, well. This is a comparison and a very visual demonstration of how big a portable washer machine is and what can fit versus a regular full-sized washer machine. All right, guys.